My name is Lou Ann Basson, and I am running for supervisor in District 4, the Sunset and Parkside areas. Are you frustrated and upset at the direction City Hall is taking San Francisco? I am, and I decided to do something about it. I will tell you about my background, why I am running, and I will talk about some important issues and proposed solutions. So, who am I? I am a retired attorney and a retired teacher of ESL, English as a Second Language, but I am not a career politician. I have lived in San Francisco since 1960. I grew up in the Haight Ashbury and attended public schools. I graduated from San Francisco State University with a bachelor's and a master's, and I graduated from UC Hastings College of the Law. I worked as a waitress through high school, college, and law school, and I worked for the federal government during and after law school. Most of my jobs were union jobs, such as with Local 2, the hotel and restaurant workers in San Francisco. I have been an attorney since 1988. I practiced labor and employment law at the city, state, and federal levels. I was a small business owner for 10 years with my own law firm, and I understand the burdens and frustrations imposed by government. My husband Larry and I got married in 1990. Larry has been a member of the International Brotherhood of Electrical Workers Local 6 for more than 50 years, and I am thrilled that his union has endorsed me as a candidate. Larry graduated from San Francisco State University with a degree in engineering, and he taught electrical engineering there until he retired. Larry and I bought our house on Noriega Street in the Sunset in 1992, and we have been Sunset residents for more than 25 years. I am running because I used to be proud to say I live in San Francisco, but now I am so embarrassed. The city is filthy and dangerous, and the politicians are not solving the problems, but only making them worse. We need someone who will say, stop, it's not working. We need to reset the paradigm and to think outside the box for solutions that work for everyone. For example, the homeless issue is costing taxpayers $350 million a year to just perpetuate and feed the problem over and over. Our streets and our transit systems are a public safety hazard every day. The homeless are about 1% of the San Francisco population, but they are holding the other 99% of us as hostages to their problems. The housing issue, likewise, cannot be solved by people demanding build more housing now, or by density rules mandated by Sacramento, or by rubber stamping zoning exemptions. We must consider the effect of our decisions and the potential consequences, such as not being environmentally sustainable. I'm talking about our water supply from Hetch Hetchy, our infrastructure, such as schools and Muni, our sandy soil in District 4, our earthquake preparedness, and our lack of an auxiliary water supply system, which ends on 19th Avenue and which does not cover the Sunset or the Parkside districts, which means fire after an earthquake is a real risk for the residents of District 4. Traffic and parking issues are controlled by SFMTA with little or no input from residents. Public safety means in District 4 we say no to cannabis dispensaries and to marijuana stores, no to needle exchanges, no to injection sites for illegal drugs, and no to navigation centers for the homeless. Vote for me because as supervisor I will continue my life's work of helping people through public service. I have declared my positions and solutions in clear language on the issues affecting San Francisco, which you can read on my website. I am not sitting on the fence and testing the political winds to decide what I should do to get the most votes. I confront problems directly and with a long-range view of consequences, instead of making unfeasible, unsustainable promises to voters. As an attorney, I fought for my clients. As supervisor, I will fight for your issues and to protect the character of our Sunset and Parkside neighborhoods. I do not make promises I cannot keep. But I can promise I will not be a political puppet, and I do not owe anything to any endorsers. I am the most conservative, the most practical, the most analytical, and the most fiscally responsible choice among eight candidates. I will be the best voice for District 4, a strong, independent, tough voice to bring balance to the Board of Supervisors and common sense to City Hall. Please vote for me for supervisor in District 4. Thank you.